All right, after a long wait and a long battle with the corrupt DOJ, Brandon Straka and the walkaway movement are back. And are they ever? Now, as you know, founder of the walkaway movement, Brandon Straka, will be hosting a debate between three black conservatives and three black liberals live in Washington, D.C. on October 15th. And he joins us right now to talk about this and some other fun stuff. Brandon, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. Brandon, it's always, always great to have you. All right, tell us about this event, what prompted it, and uh, how are you going to get the three on the left to show up? Because I'll tell you what, we invite people <laughs> from the left of, of all races and genders and sexual orientations, and you name it, on this show all the time, because I love a debate format. I can't ever get them to show up. Well, I got to tell you that you're absolutely right about that. And this event was this close to not happening. I spent literally three to four weeks <laughs> nonstop every single day uh, talking to qualified black left leaning panelists who would either say they weren't interested in doing the event, they weren't interested in doing the debate, or they would say, yes, I am interested. And then two days later, we'd get an email saying, I've changed my mind. So I, I was ready yeah. to pull the plug on this event. And then finally, uh, I was put in touch with a gentleman named Robert Patillo, who's one of our left-leaning panelists. Uh, he said that discussions like this are very important. This needs to happen. He put me in touch with the two fellow, his two co-panelists now who are representing the left-wing uh, black, debate panel and uh we signed contracts i i think they're going to show up it's going to happen and this is going to be a really dynamite conversation that is really impressive brandon and i know i can only imagine how much work it took because i'll tell you if there's yeah. one thing the producers don't want to hear from me it's please book a democrat in this segment they'd rather book donald trump much easier to book than uh, a, a democrat in in a, in a segment frankly and you know what honestly kudos to them for being willing yes. to defend their position if you're going to have a position you should be able to defend it and that's exactly what put you in the walk away movement to start with you were an activist on the left and you had this come to jesus moment uh tell us about it right so in 2018 uh well 2017 is really the when i had my walk away experience because like you said i was a two-time obama voter i voted for hillary clinton 2016 and it was really the election of donald trump that opened my eyes and got me wondering what's going on here because the media sources like cnn M msnbc the new york times uh that i trusted uh, had been telling us that he had no chance of winning whatsoever. So I went on a quest to try to understand why. And what I ultimately realized is that the media sources I trusted had been du dishonest and duplicit. And this is why this event is so important to me because it's, it's not just that they're manipulating and lying and exploiting people on the left. They're particularly lying to and man manipulating minorities, racial minorities, LGBT people. So this event is very important to me because what we want to do here is get these racially divisive issues out on the table in front of a live audience. We're going to live stream this event and we're going to put it all on the table. We're going to talk about things like critical race theory, Black Lives Matter, reparations, systemic racism, all of these narratives that are being exploited by the political left to control black people. We are going to blow the lid off of all of this in front of a live audience. I think this is going to be the event of the year. Are you going to take this to other identity groups? 100%. This is just the beginning. We're going to be doing left versus right debates for the Hispanic community, for the LGBT community. And it's not just going to be minorities. We're going to get PTA moms. We're going to get uh, people who want to protect their children. We're going to talk about immigration. Walkaway is really going to enter this space of blowing the lid off of divisive issues through live debate. And once and for all, we're going to put a lot of these false narratives that have been perpetrated by the left to rest because we're going to expose them for exactly what they are. They're lies.